Hello YouTube, welcome to another video from Are We The Baddies? I'm Ed, and today we're looking at this Nerf barricade just before it goes off to its new home. Everyone saw a million of these, big lumpy yellow things. But if you've got some time, well a lot of time, and a fair amount of model paint, I mean, let's see, can you see those the lines on there as if it was a milled piece of brass? All there. All there, those lines just to look, make it look like mill brass. And all this dirt effect. All you need is just a little time and the right model paints, which I'll show you in a second. And you can get this super beat up look, just a greasy, dirty pistol. that's had a lot of owners, probably stayed in a shed at one point and is just real beat up. Turn it around. There's the top as well that I'm really happy with. Look at the dirt just caked in the edges there. And look at that, the, I don't know, the, the port, the ejector port. But look at all that dirt just all in the top there. Oh, hold on, focus is gone. And all in the back there, look, it's just everywhere, every angle I could put this paint. It's just beat up, dirty, old, used pistol. There's some oxidization there from a charging port or something electrical. But all that there, a lot of paint went into that. And let me show you what I used for it. And there they are. There's the, all the suspects there. Let me get them all into a family shot. So first off, for this, I had to sand down all the Nerf logos because there's a big Nerf logo there. I think there's something there. The name is up there. You can see I took that off. Just put some more oxidization there. And then I primed it with, what was it, Plastic Coat Grey Plastic Primer. I don't know if there's a difference between that and the normal grey primer, but I used the grey plastic primer from Plastic Coat. And then I coated the entire thing with high coat Rover gunmetal metallic, which I covered the entire thing. Now I took the cylinder out and I took the barrel out and I painted the entire thing. These two parts were sprayed in plastic coat. Let me get you the exact type. 3090. Aero brass, and that's it there. Now that worked really well. Took about two to three coats, and as for that effect there, as if it was milled. Don't know if it can see it that well in the light. Let me move over there. There you go. See just the slight. I want to say striations. I'm not sure, but just see the slight thin lines. That was done by using plastic coat brass paint and a kind of a stiff brush which would leave lines in the paint you can't really see with the camera but they are there I promise next up all these parts here let me use a pencil here and here and here and here and the little bits there just the little details they were now from now on in we're using just citadel so that's citadel brass scorpion which gives you that lovely effect there. Now there's something else covering it, which changes the color somewhat. I'll come to that in a second. Then for these details here, this was the classic lead belcher. And then when I'd done all that, oh, and this lead belcher was there, used as there as well. So you can see how there's a difference in the silver just on the grip itself from the rest of the body. The body's gun metal. The actual palm grips, a lead belcher, and then I covered everything there, as you can see from this quite empty bottle, from Citadel Seraphim Sepia. And what I've learned the hard way to get a good even. Let me hold it up there. Let me turn around into the light. See how there's no paint marks, uh, brush marks. There's no brush strokes at all on it. 
because I didn't use a brush. I used one of these. A foam brush, which when you race it along, it just leaves all the paint and has none of those annoying lines that paint brushes leave. And I I used up pretty much this entire bottle. Where's the there it is. I used pretty much the entire bottle on this. I did one coat, then another. So like I said, it just builds up. See, that gives a good effect. See that? That gives really good. You do one, and then all, because it's a wash, it just clings to all the little parts. So it looks like there's dirt build up all over. That one's a good one. See there? You just run the brush along. Just run it at the edges and all the paint collects on the edges and tends to run down as well. So it just looks like dirt. Now for this part here, I used to make it look different because that's meant to be machine oil. All this part here, that's all meant to be machine oil dirt. This I wanted like dirt from someone's hands as if they were using it too much. I know, little detail. I used Agrax Earthshade and that was just dabbed in and then the gun tilted up at an angle so it all ran down. Let's see in there as well. I put loads on it. Let me turn this. Put all in there. There's tons of it in there. It also gives an interesting burnt effect which I'll have to use again next time. For the burnt effect that would be the sepia and then once we've done that, we were down to detailing. So the details are this little thing here, no idea. And whatever that dude is, and that. So this is, again, just Evil Sun Scarlet, because it stands out, it just pops out. It just draws your eyes to it, that's the thing. Just a little bit of colour makes all the difference. And then, finally, see that oxidisation? As if that's the positive and negative of some electrical charger or somewhat. That is the brilliant Citadel Nihil Nihilac Oxide. Any opinions on how to pronounce that, please write in. But it's all that. All that there went into that. But remember, every time you do that, you have to let it dry. And then you have to do it again. And then you have to do... So all in all, there's about two weeks work there. But it's just absolutely brilliant. I'm so happy with it. And it's thanks to Citadel, Plastic Coat and High Coat. And you get all that. And if any of you want to use all that stuff, that's exactly why I made this video. This is exactly what we should be doing, sharing our ideas and getting these cool effects. So I hope you enjoyed this video.